Hi, I'm Miriam Canfield, and I'm here at COD's new Health and Science Center. Open to students summer 2009, this 180,000 square foot structure houses both the health and science programs under one roof. Let's see what's the buzz tonight as the public tours the state-of-the-art facility during their open house. We're having an open house for the community. This morning we had about 130 high school students come in and they were going through the entire building experiencing hands-on health sciences. We want it to be the center of excellence here at College of DuPage. So we're hoping that bringing in the community that they can actually utilize our tiered lecture hall. They can rent it out and use it for their events. We want it to be part of the community and we want them to know that we're here for them. So we're very excited about this building. Earlier today we had high schools here, high school students that were coming in from the local high schools just seeing if they were interested in a career in health. Earlier tonight at 4.30 we had uh, what we call VIPs from the local community. They were in there seeing a demonstration in chemistry and they also saw our, saw our tiered lecture hall. And then tonight now it's open open house to the public and anybody who wants to come. And I'm hoping that there'll be four or 500 people coming for the doors tonight. And then they get to see COD at its very best. Can you tell us about the Teddy Bear Clinic? Yes, it's here for basically a daycare. Any kids that come with their parents to open house, it gives them a chance to learn how to dial 911. We have EMT students here teaching them how to bandage the bear and um, fix any cuts or bruises or things like that. And it just kind of gives them a quick little lesson on how to take care of yourself. And then they get to take the teddy bear home at the end. Our two certificate programs have been in line right now for about 10 years, but we are so proud that last week we just announced release of our associates in sonography. And what's unique about this program is it actually will put both certificates together and allow the student to come in in an entry-level position without health care, learn sonography, and become registered in three specialties. Tell us about the shows that you have been doing tonight. Oh, the shows I'm doing tonight are chemistry uh, demonstration show about uh, pr pretty much explosions. <laughs> um, doing some non-explosions, uh, one foaming a pumpkin where foam oozes out of, as we can see. Got some holes on our pumpkin here, and you see some foam oozing out of the pumpkin, uh, the holes there. Uh, sometime a little more than just the holes of the pumpkin. Um, so I'm, I'm doing things like that, uh, demonstrating that chemistry can be fun, not to be afraid of chemistry, and uh, things like that. So what have you been doing tonight? Tell me about the presentations. Well, we invited the community in to see our new beautiful building, including our beautiful new anatomy and physiology lab. And I thought I'd make it kind of interactive, kind of fun, so I had some activities for the students to do. I showed them a PowerPoint of, um, it was a slide that I used when we studied the brain, and it was a picture of um, several words, a series of words that were printed in different colors. So they were supposed to say the color, not the word. And it's kind of an interesting, fun activity because uh, it uh, creates conflict in the two sides of the brain. One side of the brain wants to scream out the word and the other one wants to say the color so they have trouble with it. So it's a lot of fun. For more information about the Health and Science Center and course offerings in the degree and certificate programs making use of this great new space, visit us on the web at cod.edu.